Hi, I'm Charlene Rosales, Director of Governmental Affairs for the San Luis Obispo Chamber of Commerce, here today to update you on the latest Chamber policy work. Recently, the San Luis Obispo City Council voted to move forward with a potential override of the Airport Land Use Commission's recommendations, which at this time are incompatible with the updates to the city's land use and circulation element. This action by our city council is important to existing chamber positions regarding noise and safety zones surrounding the airport, long planned housing developments in the airport area, as well as enhanced services and flights in and out of our county airport. The City Council will determine in the near future whether to move forward with this override. The Chamber is in support of two educational bonds which will be before voters this fall. Measure D, the San Luis Coastal Unified School District Bond, and Measure L, the Cuesta College Bond. Each of these measures will provide for better learning environments in order to train our future business leaders and have stronger communities. The passage of these measures align with the Chamber's long-term economic vision. The San Luis Obispo Chamber is in support of the passage of Measure G, the half percent sales tax renewal that will be before voters this fall. We believe that these funds are necessary to keep our community strong and provide for essential services over the course of the next several years. For more information, please visit citizensforg.org. Registration is now open for the Chamber's next legislative event, our San Luis Obispo City Council Candidates Forum, which will be held on Tuesday, September 23rd from noon to 1.30 at the San Luis Obispo County City Library. We have three candidates for the mayor's seat and we have five for a city council seat. You can register at slochamber.org. 